Good morning, everyone. On this Thursday morning, we're on the 25th week in Ordinary Time, and now we're in the book of Haggai, and we're in chapter 1, verses 1 through 8. On the first day of the sixth month in the second year of King Darius, the word of the Lord came through the prophet Haggai to the governor of Judah, Zerubbabel, son of Shealtiel, and to the high priest Joshua, son of Yehozadak. Thus says the Lord of hosts, this people says, the time has not yet come to rebuild the house of the Lord. Then this word of the Lord came through Haggai the prophet. Is it time for you to dwell in your own paneled houses while this house lies in ruins? Now thus the Lord of hosts, says the Lord of hosts, consider your ways. You have so much, but have brought in little. You have eaten, but have not been satisfied. You have drunk, but have not been exhilarated. You've clothed yourselves, but not been warmed. And whoever earned wages, earned them for a bag with holes in it. Thus says the Lord of hosts, consider your ways. Go up the hill country, bring the timber, and build the house, that I may take pleasure in it and receive my glory, says the Lord. The word of the Lord. Thanks be to God. Well, there are three of the minor prophets, just three, the last three remaining ones. They're prophets that are after the Babylonian captivity. Remember that uh, the, the two tribes of the south, uh, Judah and Benjamin, were taken finally into captivity. The first 10 tribes were taken in captivity by the Assyrians. And then the two last tribes, Judah and Benjamin, were taken into captivity uh, to Babylon, and then the um, Persia then took it over, and King Cyrus gave a mandate for the folks to go back. So a number of folks, not, not the vast majority, but a number of them came back to the land and started to build the temple of the Lord. That lasted for about approximately two years, and then it just kind of dwindled away. The interest was it wasn't there. There wasn't the the emphasis to do it. And so it lay kind of like in dormant for about 14 years or so. And then comes this prophetic word through Haggai about this. And he gives us uh, kind of the time frame of it by saying, in the second year of King Darius. Well, King Darius was not the king over this territory at that time. But we at least have a marker of when this was all occurring. So it was an important one. And he also gives some other important markers. He said the governor of Judah was Zerubbabel and the high priest was Joshua. So important little markers there. So there's been this lull in completing what they were supposed to be doing, which was to build the house of the Lord. And then Haggai has this, uh, this word that comes to him and he gives a word saying, you've spent a lot of time and energy making your own places real nice and comfortable, but have neglected the task of building the house of the Lord. So the last paragraph, which we read, says, consider your ways. And then there's a bunch of action words that are here. Go up into the hill country. That's the first one. Second, bring timber. Third, build the house. And the result of this, that I may take pleasure in it and receive my glory. There's a time to get to work. Oftentimes, it's most of the time. And let's be people who are about the word of God, not just simply hearers, but also doers. Stay safe, folks. Hopefully, we get to see each other soon. Bye for now.